Bloom Ring Air enables accurate location of shooters. Provides 360 degree coverage, day or night. The run up to this year's Farnborough Air Show may prove just as interesting as the actual show itself. The F-35B will make its international debut at the Royal International Air Tattoo with a follow-on performance at Farnborough after crossing the Atlantic in a flight that will require the aircraft to be refueled 10 to 12 times. Changes in world security will be driving several themes at the show. For the US, the UK and their allies, the show is in part about what will come after Afghanistan. That includes a possible agreement between the UK and France to study whether to collaborate on a demonstration and manufacturing phase of the Tehranis Unmanned Combat Air Vehicle Programme. In addition to tankers and fighters, the world market for training aircraft is heating up. With the US Air Force looking to buy at least 350 training aircraft, Alenia's M346, Korean Airspace Industries T-50 and other aircraft will be under consideration. And a major theme of the show will continue to be export sales, including the efforts of Boeing to market the KC-46A abroad. Airbus is also still looking for more global buyers of the A400M. At last year's Paris Air Show, Russia showed off the Sukhoi Su-35's moves, but with the ongoing tension in Ukraine, and with NATO beefing up its presence in Eastern Europe, expect a more muted presence from Russia this year. The Aviation Week team will be at the show, bringing you news, analysis, videos and photos online, in print and on your mobile.